He was unmistakable. With his suave demeanor, impeccable wardrobe, and bullet head, on screen, Eric von Stroheim played sadistic and sometimes seductive Prussians. Von Stroheim was somebody who presented himself as so solid, such a force of nature, that when he came onto the scene, he didn't have to say a word, and you somehow have to respond to this man. As a director, von Stroheim earned a reputation for unparalleled egomania, arrogance, and self-indulgence. His constant changes of story, his never being satisfied with sets, his almost obsessive detailing of things, whereas that's one of his great strengths, it also became his greatest liability. He just was not a great businessman. He was a great artist. I don't go by schedules prepared by lunatics with stopwatches counting words on a page. I find my inspiration everywhere. I embroider, I paint. Red here, blue here, I compose. This is how I work. Though he was fired by nearly every studio he worked for, and most of the films he directed were finished by others or destroyed, What Remains offers a glimpse of one of Hollywood's pioneers, one whom everyone loved to hate. Mm -hmm.